This is the permanent site of the National Institute of Legislative and Democratic Studies, NILS, situated along the airport road in the Federal Capital Territory. The Speaker of the House of Representatives, Mr. Femi Bajabi Amila, the Director General of the Institute, Mr. Abubakar Sulaiman, and officials of Julius Berger Construction Company are here to inspect the project. Mr. Bajabi Amila is dissatisfied with the level of work on the project. Yeah, I'm very disappointed that we're still at this stage and that there's nobody working. The permanent site of the Institute is estimated to cost over 50 billion naira. Channel's television's attempt to speak to the project coordinator for Julius Berger did not succeed. However, off-camera, he states that the company still owed a substantial outstanding amount of contract. You can do your final but that is uh, roughly about 50 something billion. And now we have, uh, we have done for the, same, for, the, for the same billion for the phase one. They are standing according to the, uh, their position before our government council about a year ago was to say well, they require seven point something billion, seven point five billion to complete, and now we have two point five billion in the budget. So, and we are still talking to the executive to grant us more intervention. I think that should be okay for them to do something. They pledge, they promise the mail to us that they will move back to sites, they renege on their promise, and that is where the speaker is furious that this project, this edifice must be commissioned in the next 30 days by Mr. President before he leaves office. The institute is established to strengthen the legislative capacity of federal lawmakers. At a separate event in the National Assembly, the President of the Senate met with the management of a National Assembly Service Commission, where he emphasized the need for the Commission and the National Institute of Legislative and Democratic Studies to build the capacity of first-time legislators who will make up a significant number in the 10th Assembly. What this means is in the 10th Assembly, we must make provision immediately for capacity building for members of the National Assembly that will be new. If we want to achieve our goals and our set targets. Senator Lawan also wants the permanent site of the institute to be completed promptly, as well as a provision of a befitting accommodation for the National Assembly Service Commission.